With the pace of the game constantly evolving, it's never been more important to work on your speed. And not only is it important to be quick running forwards, but it's also important to be fast moving in all directions with and without the ball. And the four drills I'm gonna show you today work on exactly that. So for all four of today's drills, we're gonna be using the exact same cone setup. I've placed four cones around the outside to form a square. Each of the cones is five steps apart and I've placed one exactly in the middle. So we're gonna be doing repetitions with and without the ball. So for the first exercise, this is what it looks like. We start at any of the cones around the corners. We're gonna run forwards, push laterally. So we're going from side to side. Then we're gonna go backwards, making sure we're pumping those arms back to the start, get low, push off. Then we're gonna go all the way around in the opposite direction. Then we're gonna get on the ball and we're gonna work on some ball mastery. So once again, starting at any of the cones, we're gonna use our sole the entire time. Our body is always facing forwards. Then we're gonna use our sole, our left sole, across the front, sole backwards, right foot across, back to the start. Then we're gonna do the exact same thing in the opposite direction. So go three or four times in both directions without the ball, three or four times with the ball. For the second drill, we're gonna work around the outside of the square once again, but this time we're gonna work on our turns, both 90 degrees and 180 degrees. So we start at any corner, we're gonna drive forwards. This time, once we get to the cone, we're gonna turn our body 90 degrees, exploding around each corner. And once we get back to the start, plant our foot, drive in the opposite direction, then we're gonna work on our opposite turns so that we're getting a balance on both sides. Then, once we repeat three or four reps of that, we're gonna get on the ball and we're gonna dribble up. Then it's a 90 degree turn all the way around to the start. Then we're gonna swap feet and go the opposite way with our left foot, keeping close control, sharp cuts, till we get back to the start. So three or four reps without the ball and three or four reps with the ball. Moving into the third drill, now we're gonna work on sharper turns. So more like 45 degrees instead of that 90 degrees. So a little bit sharper here, we're gonna start at any of the four corners, drive into the middle this time, exploding out up to this top cone. Then we're gonna go straight across, around that cone back to the middle, out, pushing that ground away, and back to the start. Then rest for 10 to 15 seconds. Then we're gonna go the opposite way. So on the first way up, we turn to the left. Now with that middle cone, we're gonna to turn to the right. So drive up, sharp turn right, straight up, around that cone into the middle, straight up and back to the start. I'd recommend two in each direction and then we're gonna get on the ball and do the exact same thing. So we drive into the middle, close around that cone, around, straight across, into the middle once again. Try and use both feet if you can, all the way back to the start. And then we're gonna do the same thing, once again, changing the direction. So we went left the first time, now we're gonna turn right at that first cone. Up to the top, into the middle, out to the top, and back to the start, trying to make good use of both feet. So I recommend four for on the ball and off the ball, two in each direction. And for the fourth and final drill, we're gonna start at any of the cones once again. This time we're driving into the middle forwards and then we're gonna backpedal 45 degrees in the opposite direction around that bottom cone forwards, backpedal 45 degrees, forwards 45, and then back to the start. Rest for 10 to 15 seconds, come out to the opposite side. We're gonna do the exact same thing in the opposite direction. So forwards, 
backwards, around that cone, forwards, backwards, lots of little steps, pushing that ground away, all the way back to the start. Then we're gonna get on the ball after we've done four repetitions of that, two in each direction. So we drive to the middle, place our foot on top of the ball, around the front, back pedal, up forwards, back pedal, on the ball once again, get around that top cone, all the way back to the start, rest for 10 to 15 seconds, come to the other side, dribble out, foot on top of the ball, back pedal, forwards, back pedal, on the ball, turn around that cone, back to the start, and that's where we finish. So we're gonna do four repetitions with the ball, four repetitions without, making sure we're changing direction every two reps. So there's four drills you can use to work on your multi-directional speed with and without the ball. Before you go, make sure you subscribe to the Unisport channel and click those bell notifications so you never miss a future video. Also check out the playlist down below if you want more awesome football videos. And if you want to get the Puma Ultras for yourself, click the link over here which will take you to the Unisport store where you can get these for yourself. But I'm 7MLC, until next time, I'm out.